Hi, it's Apostle Rosalyn Solomon. This is Rosalyn Solomon's YouTube channel. If you hear noise, that's my electric fan. <laughs> um, I came to share a dream with you. So, Father, in the name of Shua Jesus, let me tell this vision with precise and accuracy through the Holy Spirit. And I cover this video with the blood of Shua Jesus. I was asking God yesterday about the Iraqi dinar. I was like, Lord, is is it going to turn out to be a scam? I'm like, I know I've had multiple um, dreams about it over, since 2014 that it would revalue. I said, but it, why is it taking so long? I said, is it still worth it to hang in there? And I had asked him to show me or tell me. So this is not financial advice, nor my money guru. I'm just giving you a dream. So I have fell, fell asleep, like taking a nap. And he showed me this Iraqi looking king you know, they look well, Arab, whatever they are, but he was Iraqi and he was a king. And he, there was a subject, I think he he was the man, a subject or some somebody. And he did something really, really nice for the king. So the king was up high and the subject was like looking up to the king. So because he did a good, noble thing for the king, the king gave him a lot of money. And I said in the vision, you know, I'm talking in the vision. I'm like, that's not American money. I said, I've seen that money before. I said, wait a minute. Those are $5,000 and $10,000 Iraqi bills because they were purple. And I know the Iraqi, I tried to find a picture, but I couldn't. I know the Iraqi $5,000 bill and $10,000 bill was purple. I don't know if it still is purple or bluish purple, um, but I don't know if they're still that color. Hopefully they are. <laughs> and he gave him a lot of those $10,000 and $5,000. Uh, it was a lot. And then in the vision, I, I, I said, wow, those things are worth 50 cents to $1.25 in America. So I was saying in a dream that for every Iraqi dinar, it would be worth fifty cent to a hundred to a dollar twenty five cent. And then I saw and then then the Lord took me and then I saw it. It started out fifty cent, then it went to a dollar twenty five. But I don't know if it went to a dollar twenty five in a day, a couple of days, a week, a month, I don't know. But then after it had hit a peak of a dollar twenty five, it went back down to seventy five cents. And it stayed there. And I remember telling God, Lord, I don't care if it's 25 cents. I got enough to make a piece of change at 25 cents. And then the Lord showed me again, it was 50 cents. And then it went to $1.25. And then after a short while, it balanced out to 75 cents. And in a dream, I heard God say that the Iraqi dinar would not revalue the way people think. So then in the dream, I asked him, I said, well, are the people in America still going to be able to cash in and, and, and get money from it? And he said, yes. And then he showed me 50 cent again and then to a dollar 25. And then after a little while, it settled at 75 cent. That's what I saw in a dream. So will it be 50 cent? Mm. Will it be go to a dollar 25 mm. and settle at 75 cent? Mm. But that's what I saw in the vision, y'all. And this king, he was huge. He was, you know, not huge like Yah and daddy and mama, but he was like a giant. And the subject had did something really, really nice for him. And he blessed him with, a, it, it had to be millions of dollars of those 5,000, 10,000 Iraqi dinars. Somebody let me know if they still purple or purple, purple, blue, something like that. All right. But I knew I did at first I, when I saw it, I was like, that's not American money. That's foreign money. And then I said, that money looks familiar to me. I said, that's a Iraqi dinar, right? And it was worth 50 cent, y'all. Like, let's say you got a million Iraqi dinar times 50 cent. What is that? A couple of hundred thousand or 500,000? Yeah, 500,000. What? After Uncle Sam get his, you still be doing good. Uncle Sam probably get 15, 20%. But you still be doing good. <laughs> so that's the vision I had. So like I said, I'm not a money guru or giving you financial advice to tell you to go and buy any of this Iraqi. I'm just telling you what I saw. 
And I had just asked the father yesterday, was it was it, was it turning into a scam? You know, I know I saw it going to digital and it did, you know, and I, all these other dreams. Because I was like, Daddy, it's getting tiresome. Why are they fighting? And, 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 and he sure enough showed me confirmation. <laughs> so God bless y'all. So I'll be seeing y'all this weekend. I got some things to do over the next couple of days. So I'll be seeing y'all this weekend, TikTok and YouTube. So you guys enjoy the rest of your week. And may you have testimonies when we talk again. Love you guys. Keep me in prayer as I do you. And remember, love is all you have. And who is love? Yahuda HaMashiach, the Ruach, and, and Yeshua, and Daddy Yahuda. They are our love. And stay encouraged. I know things are rough out here. I know things is getting rough, but stay encouraged and stay in prayer because the righteous prevaileth much. And we could be in the midst of a famine, whatever, and we would still shine. And God will still use us to bring souls to him. God will never neglect nor forget his children. And we and he will bless us in the midst of everything. And just remember that and, and don't give up. Don't give up. Keep Keep the love. Keep the faith. Keep the hope. Because God is going to come through for a lot of us very soon. Much love. Shalom.